Hello everybody and uh, welcome to my top six large tractor picks with me Brian Brew Royalty. Well we're here on the hills of Slovenia. It's a lovely little small map and you might be thinking to yourself well why do you pick a small map to show off large tractors? Well in real life these large tractors are absolutely huge and I think when they get put on a big American map they can sometimes look very small and in reality they are huge so we're going to put them on a small map and we're going to make them look huge so these are my top six picks of my favorite modded tractors large tractors in game they may not be your top six picks but they're mine they're in no particular order just the way i like them but these are the ones i've used the most and fs19 is coming to an end so let's just showcase them off so here without further ado is my first pick here it is inside this tunnel it's the Agco 1000 series. It's by Aran Modding. It costs 329,000 for the base model. And the base model comes with 396 horsepower. This one has 517 horsepower. And of course it comes in all different colors. Challenger and Fent and everything. Because it's part of the Agco group. But just look at it. I mean what a tractor. Look at the lines. The stunning. It's absolutely amazing. It also does 63 kilometers an hour. Let's start this engine up. I mean, is that not brilliant or what? It's got a little sunroof on it up there. See the sunroof going up and down? I mean, that's pretty cool. It's also got back window opens and the door opens the side. See that open? There we go. Is that not cool or what? I think it's pretty cool. We're closing these now because we're about to do some stunt driving. Look inside when you hop into it. Watch, just hop into it again. Steering wheel comes down to fit you. Nice. These animations, I really like this. It's got 517 horsepower, so what's not to like? Here we go. Let's just see if we can't make it over these little rocks here. No, no problem at all. Whee! Just look at it. I actually like to really like in-game fed colors. Pretty really cool, but if you watch the driver on this, he watches a layer seat bouncing him up and down. It's adjusting his height up and down. 63 kilometers an hour. Let's see if we can't get that up along here. Let's do the sawmill part of the map. Mm. There we go, 62, close enough. Let's not break it, it's just on higher. This is the sound of it. I really like it. I love this. This is the one I always want to get because it's not articulated or anything like that and it's got 500 horsepower. I mean, if it, that's not on your list, I don't know which one will be. Now, let's go to number two on the list. Actually, I'll show you the little PDA of the map. There it is, tiny little map, Rusty Money Gaming. If you're watching this, how come you've never done a little vintage survival on this one? It's right up your alley. It's got lovely little lanes and byways and stuff, and it's a European map. So, I think it's just around the corner here. Here it is. This is the Thunder by Emerson Dentino. It's like the, it's like the Steiger edition, but this is just, look at it. Look how mean it is. Uh, base price, 350000 700 horsepower let's hop up into it let's have a look in cab not much in cab fairly sparse there you go turn it on speedometer works in it everything works in it see the speedometer there going on the dash if you look down the right hand corner 75 kilometers an hour and listen barely fits on the road I really like this. I love the animation of the tracks. Okay. If you need 700 horsepower, 
if this is kind of the one to get. I think the motor's done an absolute great job on this. Speed. Knock it off there before I blow the engine in it or something. Actually, meant to show you that the PTO on this one. If you look in here, little details like the PTO spinning. I love all that. If I need something with lots of horsepower, this is a go-to for me. Just a bit of fun. We'll move on now onto our turp pick. It's down over here. Down on here. Yep. It reminds me of that song. What's that coming over the hill? Is it a monster? Well, no. It's not a monster, but what it is, is it's a John Deere. And it's this one is the John Deere 8960. The base model is the 8760. It's by SIID Modding. And the base price of this is 79,000. 79,000. It's the price of a trailer. This got 300 horsepower and it gets maxed up to 370 horsepower. And I really like the old vintage look of this. I really like all this. When I'm watching the American farmers on YouTube. If they had something like this, I'd be like, whoa. Let's start her up. She's got green star. She's got all the bells and whistles. Um, I think the door opens on this one as well. Yeah, that's yeah. Isn't that cool? Love it. Let's just get around getting up. You can hear this old engine just rumbling. Top speed of 32 kilometers an hour. That's all this needs. We can get down along the roads. Pretty good. Gets up and down these hills here. Pretty good. You can pull anything. Nice and slow. Down into the low range gear. 14 kilometers an hour. I really like this. I don't ever really play with John Deere's much in game because of slot count. But this one here. 79,000 to buy you can't afford not to have it and it actually works really well for an articulated tractor as well I really like this one you know so let's go number four on our list it's just over here hidden cleverly hidden behind a bus stop whoops looks like someone's got their hunting camp up here well there'll be no deer around today sorry friend I do apologize. Go down on the road here. Oop. Keep going down along here. Cleverly hidden down here. No one will spot it. Definitely not. Down here hidden behind this bus stop. Just a little tour of the map as well. You can see a little few bits. Can you see what it is? Are you able to see what it is? Oh, hey, it's the big bud 747. This is the 16 valve edition. This is the this is the modded version of the in-game version. And I really like this. I love the sound of it. I love how big it is. I love that it's a real tractor in real life. This is the big bud 16 valve 747. It's by JHHG Modding. It costs 315,000 to buy, but it has 1100 horsepower. I mean, if you got something that 1100 horsepower can't put, you're in big trouble. Look at the size. Look at the size. I absolutely love this one. It's got the front bonnet that opens up so you can see the engine in there. Look at that for a radiator cooler system. I absolutely love it. Lovely animations on it as well. And of course the door opens and closes as you can see because the door is open. Let's just look inside. Look how 80s that is. Square. Everything. Oh. Big TV inside now. Not so bad. Lots of levers. That's what you want. Some sort of a handle that you pull to eject the passenger maybe. I'm not sure. Let's go on this hill. 1100 horsepower. Is there anything that this can't pull? I don't think so. Goes up to 32. 
kilometers an hour as well. I mean, look at that. It's like a... I don't even know. It's just so cool. I really like Big Bud. I love that it's in game. Let's take it down along this dirt track here. Let's see how it handles. In between all these trees. No problem at all. No problem to the Big Bud. Look at that. I mean, is there a better big tractor? Is this the best big tractor? I think so, maybe. Maybe. It's in my top six. Big bud. What's not to like? Okay, we'll leave that one there. Let's go on to our next pick. Hidden. Cleverly hidden down here as well. But not behind that bus stop. Yup. Well, I assume it's a bus stop. I didn't check. Yeah, I'd say it is. next one it's all the way up along here just give you a little sense of the map as well while we're here I presume a lot of you wouldn't have seen this before uh, most of the maps actually that say 19 at the end of them uh, are ones that were on maybe 17 or 15 and they've been modded up so let me know in the comments if it is I don't remember this map before in any of the other ones maybe so there's our next tractor down here the beast this next tractor is the Class Challenger 95E. It's got dog written on it because it can't put cat, but we all know what it is. And you might be looking at this going, hmm, how did this one get in? Well, I'll tell you how this one got in. This costs 100000 to buy. 100000 And guess what? It has 510 horsepower. I mean, it doesn't look too bad inside. It's got nice animations. Let's start her up. Yeah. It's running on pure black it'll turn on the dime like this it turns in its own circle it'll pretty much pull anything it can't really get stuck anywhere I mean, some of these tractors are you know very hard to drive I find this one actually quite easy I like to hook stuff up to it and just you know pull away got a big trailer that's full this guy will pull it. Get up and down these hills, no bother. And I love that it's a. I love that it has dog instead of cat on it. I think that's cool. Well, that's one way of getting around that. The fun police on the consoles that we can't have those, all those brands. But that's what it is on console, and I mean, it's just, just brilliant. You know, this is by JA Modding. In case I didn't say that before. A hundred thousand to buy. Not everyone's cup of tea, maybe. But the price. I think for the price, definitely gets in. And here we go now. Last but not least. Hidden down here. There it is. Right behind that house. Take you down along here. Just look at that backdrop over there. Across that water. There's a church over there. Can you get over to it? I don't know. You'll have to see for yourselves. Download a map and give it a try. Not sure what happened there. A glitch. And here it is. This is the GNU series by Emerson Dentino. His second entry into the my top six. Its base price is 380000 And it comes with 700 horsepower. It can go up to 800 horsepower. And the best thing about this is. Look at that top speed. 65. If you start this. You'll know all about power. Listen to that roar. It's really quick this one. Really quick. 800 horsepower. Working really hard. Let's go over here. Scare these deer. What a beast. It just looks like it could just take on anything. I really like it. I know it's a bit expensive or whatever, but 800 horsepower. And look how fast it is. Power slide. 
think it looks really well actually. Looks really well inside. There's your speedometer there. Pedals are working. I think this looks really nice. I think you've done a great job on this as well. It's terror up the hills as well, being it. Yes, I didn't like that one. So, that's it, folks. That's the six of them. My top six picks large tractors for FS19. You know. I hope you really enjoyed it. I hope there's maybe one tractor at least on this that you haven't seen before. Uh, I like that. I like to showcase new things. I hope you haven't seen this map maybe before and you've just seen it now for the first time. Thanks everyone for watching. Please give me a like if you can. If you haven't subscribed, please do. I appreciate all my subscribers. As ever, any comments in the box, I'll reply to them. And uh, Thanks everyone for watching. And I'll see you again soon.